everyone, it's Living the Good Life and it's time for part two of my estate sale finds video. Uh, and if you remember, I got everything in this basket for $5 and I dug and dug through a closet trying to see what I could find and here's some of the things that I found. So let's start off and these, this is the sterling area. The very first thing I found were these little uh, bear paw Native American earrings and then I found these are all sterling the little angels the little maple leaf charm here are some vintage sterling maybe that's aquamarine I don't know but they're screw back um, and then here's some really neat Native American earrings and they are signed let me look oh, it just says sterling and those are fun here is a little angel uh, then we have some starfish earrings, uh, and these are some other sterling hoops, and these are little some black onyx and sterling. And then uh, let's see, we have a little ring, and these little look at these little elk ones, they're so funny. Uh, oh, and there's a teeny tiny little fish. I'm about to sneeze, you'll have to excuse me. There is a cross. A sterling chain and look there's a Hershey's kiss that is silver and then there are these I guess opal or opalesque <laughs> oh, these are almost got a little bear paw I don't know what that is there but that is neat uh, if you come up here I found this set with the pin and the earrings and I found them separately and this is listener so that's nice that's a good name an old price sticker there um, then there was an entire box of all these little organization pins um, Girl Scouts and all kinds of stuff oh sorry up here I uh, found these and let's see if I can tell you what they are but I don't think they were marked nope but they were awfully pretty. I uh, found a lady's older watch. This is a beautiful vintage set. Let me get up a little bit and I'll look at the earrings and see if I can remember. So look at the detail on that. Those are really pretty. This is Crown Jafari. And I have the necklace. Woo, one of them fell off the earrings. And a bracelet as well. And they all are wanting to fall. There we go. <laughs> Of course, when I'm filming. I got a, um, a real stone necklace. It has the barrel clasp, but it's, so it's an older one. I got all of these copper bracelets. So if I have a problem with my hand, maybe I should start trying one. I got a compact, which of course is something I forgot to show you in the last video. And this one says Zell. So I've got the original box. That is so pretty. Look at that. Huh. I got a James Avery box. It doesn't have anything in it just because I had some James Avery stuff. And then I got this, uh, which is uh, the earring and necklace set, and there's no name on that. I have a hummingbird pin. And then I have these items that I had in this little cloisonne box, which is really fun. Um, I thought they might be gold, they're hollow, but I've tested them and they're not. I'll probably keep them when I get new acids and test again, but they just turned out to be costume. You remember this from last video. It was the 14 karat gold watch that is broken. And that's gonna be kind of the whole story you see down here, but this is gold. So this is mainly 14 karat gold. There's a couple of pieces of 10 karat, but, um, Broken bracelet, broken bracelet, broken bracelet, broken bracelet. <laughs> okay, bracelet. Uh, this bracelet's coming unraveled, so it's broken. This watch uh, is good. This is the second, sorry, second 14 karat gold watch that I found. And I had no idea until I got home. I just threw these in there. Well, yep. Right there, 14 karat. has a beautiful band 
So that one was lovely. I've got a little pendant. I've got a pair of these little post earrings. And um, then I've got a pair of these that are broken as well. Here are earrings that are okay. And I think these may be the 10 karat ones. And then here is a single for 18 karat gold um, earring. So that is everything I found. Um, so this is probably uh, $3 worth. <laughs> so I don't even know what that calculates out. I didn't do the math. I hope you enjoyed everything. Send me some comments if you know anything about this costume jewelry. Um, and hopefully I will be able to, oh, let me go ahead and, and weigh it for you. I should have done that. Hopefully I'll know a little bit more about some of this stuff. I did go to another family run estate sale and um, before this one and it, um, it was good on the gold too. I got a, a bag full of jewelry for, oh man, I just messed up. Bag full of jewelry for $50. So not as good as this one, but very good anyways. And I have been trying to untangle everything. That's one of the reasons why I got it for $50 is nobody would want to untangle that. So here is everything that I've got on the scale. And it's 26.4 grams of 10, 14, and 18 karat, mainly 14. Plus, I have these two watches that I really haven't weighed. So you can do the math. It was an incredible deal. I hope you enjoyed everything. And I'd love to hear from you and I'd appreciate your subscription. Take care. Bye-bye.